Welcome to North Shore Sports Week for January 19th to 24th. All the crazy action in one crazy place. This week we've got basketball, wrestling, gymnastics, rugby, and basketball. Hey, did I mention the basketball? With the season winding down and the playoffs looming, there was plenty of hardwood action this past week. In Division II basketball on Wednesday, January 21st, it was the 2-2 Bodwell Bruins at home facing the 3-4 Rock Ridge Ravens. Basketball is a game of communication, and for many of the Bodwell players, English is not their native language. Rockwell dominated the game, but the Bruins would show flashes of brilliance at both ends of the court. Score at the half, Rock Ridge 37, Bodwell 10. Rockridge added to their lead in the second half and would go on to win it 67-20. Aye, carumba! On Tuesday, January 20th, the West Vancouver Highlanders made the trip to Collingwood to face the Cavaliers. Ranked AAA to Collingwood's AA status, this should have been an easy victory for West Van, but nobody told those wascally wabbits the Cavaliers. <laughs> Collingwood opened a lead early in the game and fought their way through the first two periods to keep it. Score at the half, Cavaliers 42, Highlanders 26. In the second half, although West Van applied pressure and fought back, the Cavaliers went on to win 44-41. In North Shore Premier League play, the game of the week was Hansworth Royals at Argyle Pipers. Ranked first and second on the North Shore and second and third provincially, these two great teams play an entertaining, hard-hitting style and are always fun to watch. Argyle gave it their best shot, but the Royals went on to win in convincing fashion, 63-42. That's it for the Pipers in regular season play. We'll keep you posted on the playoff picture. One game left for Hansworth on the road against the Carson Graham Eagles on Wednesday, January 28th at 7.30. Get out and watch the action. In other premier play, it was the Royals at home over the Eagles, 71-37. In Division One, Sentinel roasted the Ravens, and Mulgrave won a squeaker at home over the STA Fighting Saints. On the guys' side, this weekend saw a Bantam tournament at Argyle, organized by Argyle's grade 12 marketing class. Justin Lee explains. A group of six students um, organized uh, this tournament, uh, 18 tournament. Um, it's over the, uh, over the course of two days. Um, there's pretty much winner plays on, and there's a consolation round as well. In house on double A play, the Mulgrave Titans played host to the St. Thomas Aquinas Fighting Saints. The 0-3 Titans built an early lead, and it took STA a while to get their motors going. But when they did, the Saints went marching in. Let's go! Score at the half, Fighting Saints 30, Titans 17. Visitors continued their strong play in the third and fourth periods, and while Mulgrave would make a game of it, the Saints took this one, 61-36. Next up for Mulgrave, a game at home against the Seacove Seahawks on Tuesday, January 28th at 7.30. Don't miss the action. In house on AAA, the big game saw the Hansworth Royals take on the unbeaten Eagles at Carson on Thursday, January 22nd. The Eagles had beaten the Royals at Hansworth in a close game the week before, and the visiting side was looking for some payback. These two teams are closely matched, and the action was fast and furious in the first half. Number 21 for Carson is Vernon Tate. His mom Jackie lives in Alberta and emailed me to say that she can see Vernon play by watching North Shore Sports Week online. Hi, Jackie. Vernon says he's doing fine. I'll say. Score at the half. Carson Graham, 38. Hansworth, 36. (laughs) 
in the second half, both sides tightened defensively and went at each other hard. This was going to be a close one. Score at the end of regulation was tied at 68. Yes, we're going to overtime. In the extra period, Carson pushed hard. While the Royals were solid on defense, they just couldn't manage to put the thing in the other thing. Final score, Carson Graham Eagles 73, Hansworth 70. Coming up for Carson, a home game against the West Van Highlanders on Tuesday, January 27th at 7.30. Hansworth takes on the Argyle Pipers, also at home on January 27th, game time 7.30.